Good morning, good afternoon, good evening um, to everybody. Um, today we're going to talk about salary. As you can see, we're talking about salary and piece work. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to talk about salary. What is salary? A salary is a fixed amount of money earned on a regular basis. This money can be earned whether it's going to be weekly, bi-weekly, can be semi-monthly, can be monthly, can be annual. All right, so... Things to remember, if you go to slide 12, on slide 12 of the lesson, you're going to see, it's going to say weekly, there's 52 weeks in the year. Bi-weekly, there's 26 bi-weekly. Semi-monthly, there's 24. And monthly, there's 12 months in the year. All right. So how do I figure out the salary per pay period? All right. This is my annual salary. Annual salary means the amount I get per year. All right. And divided by the number of per periods per year. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at a few examples. All right. It's nothing crazy. We're just going to look at a few examples and then, you know, you can figure it out. So let's go ahead and look at the first example here. So it says, Beth is a computer programmer. Her annual salary is 42648 What is her monthly salary and what is her weekly salary? So the first thing that we're going to do here is we're going to figure out her monthly salary. All right. Her monthly salary is equals to her annual salary, which is, as we see here, is 42,000. So it's going to be 42,648. It's the annual salary divided by the per period, number of pay period. Because it says monthly, we know that there's 12 months in the year. So we're going to divide this by 12. All right, so when I go to my calculator, as I'm gonna put it here so you guys can see, so I go on and I clear and I go 42, 6, 48 divided by 12, and it's telling me that each month, right? So each month she is receiving 3,554. All right, and this is her monthly salary. So again, it asks, it says, find her monthly salary and her weekly salary. So now we're going to have to find her weekly. All right. So her weekly salary is equals to her annual salary, which is 42,648. And it's divided by weekly. So we know that there's 52 weeks in the year. So I'm going to go back and I'm going to say, Four two six four eight divided by fifty two, and it's going to tell me that she makes what? She get makes eight hundred and twenty dollars and fifteen cents weekly. All right. Do not get it confused that because you find the monthly here, you're going to divide this by four. All right. It's not accurate that there's only four four weeks in a month all right so you got to go back to her annual salary and divide it by the weekly all right and as you can see it's nothing crazy all right so let's look at a little a problem that's a little bit more complex all right so here it says a hospital advertised a radiology technician at a monthly salary of four thousand six hundred eighty what is the annual salary what is the weekly salary so now i need to find the annual salary i know what the the monthly is, right? The monthly, I know that there's 12 months in a year. So the annual salary, I can figure out the annual salary by saying, I'm going to take the monthly salary, which is 4680 and I'm going to multiply it by 12. Why by 12? Because there's 12 months in a year. All right. So if I take 4680 80 and I multiply by 12, it's going to give me a total of 56, 160. So this is my annual salary. So now that I have my annual salary, I can go ahead and find my weekly. Again, be careful. You cannot just divide the monthly by four to get the weekly. No. So my weekly salary is equals to my annual salary, which is 56,160 divided by 52. Why 52? Because there's 52 weeks in the year. All right. So if I divide that by 52, it's going to give me a total of 
1080 all right so her weekly salary is 1080 so on this problem we just had to work reverse all right so it's nothing crazy on this problem we just got to work reverse. remember you cannot divide the monthly by four to get the weekly you have to use the annual salary divided by 52 all right if you have any questions feel free to reach out to me or come to office hours and i'll be more than happy to help you guys all right have a good one